Coming up on Around Kern County, we're sharing how you can get into the holiday spirit by helping local foster children in need. And we're giving you a delicious inside look at the new restaurant that just opened up inside of our administrative building. When Around Kern County starts now. You're taking a look at video captured from the Kern County Fire Department as they responded to a major warehouse fire last week in East Bakersfield. Welcome into this week's Around Kern County. I'm your host, Ali Triolo. We're kicking off this week's show by celebrating our Kern County Fire Department for working tirelessly throughout the last few weeks, from responding to local emergencies to tackling flames in other counties. We are so thankful for their service. KCFD has been supporting firefighting efforts in Ventura as crews have worked to combat the mountain fire. To learn more about joining their workforce, just visit kerncountyfire.org. It's officially that time of year where you can get into the holiday spirit by helping local foster children in need. This week, Kern County's Department of Human Services kicked off their 37th annual Holiday Cottage with a grand opening event and press conference. The Holiday Cottage is a program that helps our foster children receive gifts during the holidays. Um, it's definitely a hard time sometimes for foster children who are um, not in their home during this holiday season. and so. Uh, the Holiday Cottage really gives them a chance to ask for a wish, ask for what they want for this holiday season. And um, we, um, our organization, this program really goes out, works with the community and helps them fulfill those wishes. Um, we know holidays are hard and it's definitely a time of giving and so helping, uh, helping children uh, during this time is really, really what the spirit is about. And um, seeing the smiles on the children as they receive a wish that they ask for is genuinely really heartwarming to really see how happy they are to get what they wish for during the holidays. Each year, the Holiday Cottage receives wish requests from over 700 children living in foster care. And starting now, you can help make sure these wishes come true. This year, there are multiple ways you can give. You can visit the actual Holiday Cottage at 3043 Wilson Road from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. during the weekdays to choose a wish to fulfill. You can also choose a child's specific request online by visiting their website at kernholidaycottage.com. You can also give a monetary donation and Human Services will directly purchase the child's wish. To donate or learn more, please visit kernpartnership.com. And Kern County Supervisors are giving November a special meeting by proclaiming it as National Adoption Awareness Month during this week's board meeting. For more than two decades, this campaign has been celebrated across the country with one common goal in mind, to educate people about the thousands of children currently in foster care, in need of loving families and permanent homes, especially teens, sibling groups, and children with special needs. So I have an adoption journal here that I've kind of kept track of things. So I just want to read one journal entry from Remy's Adoption Day. This day, nothing really changed except that it was legal. But it felt real when we picked you up. It felt real when you bonked your head on a toy and turned to me for comfort. It felt real when the bio parental rights hearing happened and it felt real when you stared at me with your big brown eyes while drinking your milk. It felt real when I heard Ryan singing to you as he rocked you to sleep. It felt real when your Nana said that she wanted us to keep you because we love you and we'll take you places. It felt real when you threw your dinner at me. <laughs> it's always been real, my sweet boy. I love you. Love, Mama. So. To learn more about National Adoption Awareness Month, please visit kcdhs.org. If you're looking for a meaningful career geared towards benefiting the well-being of our residents, look no further than joining the Kern County Behavioral Health and Recovery Services team. On Saturday, November 16th, you can learn more about the organization's open positions at the Kern BHRS Fall Career Expo. It kicks off at 9 in the morning and goes until 1 in the afternoon 
at their main county building located at 2001 28th Street in Bakersfield. Kern BHRS provides a wealth of mental health services to our community as their department is dedicated to helping our neighbors who are struggling with their mental health, addiction, and other issues. If you're looking to join this field and make a difference right here in Kern County, you can get a jump start on applying for current vacancies. Just visit kerncounty.com careers to get started today. Our Kern County Administrative Building is excited to welcome a new restaurant to the first floor for employees and the public to enjoy. Anna Marie Odo is there now with an inside look. Hey Allie, I'm standing outside the County Administrative Center at the new Delicious Kitchen. Come with me and let's go check it out. I'm here with Ronnie Caceres, owner of Delicious Kitchen. He and his family operate this wonderful new restaurant in our County Administrative Center, and he's gonna tell us a little bit about the operational hours of the new place. Hey guys, Ronnie here with Delicious Kitchen. Uh, so we're here Monday through Friday from 7.30 to 5 p.m. Uh, we open up for breakfast, lunch, uh, and we're here till 5 o'clock if you want to come grab a good coffee or something after hours. Uh, we make really good paninis, everything made from scratch. We got great bread from a, a small French bakery that bakes our bread. All our stuff is made from scratch, fresh, breakfast burritos. We got good um, coffee, our espresso machine. It's all Italian beans. It's um, grinded to order, so really good coffee. As soon as you walk in the building, you can smell the coffee. All right. We try the Camillas Panini that she helped us build. It's our pork confit, we cooked it for several hours. It's got garlic aioli, the melted cheese, fresh avocado, cilantro and onions. How you good? And that does it for us on this week's Around Kern County. If you have a story you'd like to share, please visit kerncounty.com and fill out our Submit a Story form. And don't forget to follow us on social media or download the MyKern app in the App Store or Google Play. We'll see you next time.